we find now? Hmm. In terms of defense, I got like yeah, I could get rid of cold and I could get rid of like hey, I don't have lightning. Uh, I could get rid of cold damage. The thing is, I'm dealing some cold damage, but right now I'm actually doing uh, dealing fire damage there, and that's neat. So yeah, in feeble, um, E and for evil. Uh, no way, this was just reduce damage, crit multiplier, and whatnot. Yeah, reduced accuracy, crit strike multiplier, and yeah, 29% less damage. That is the only good thing about this skill. But there's another curse. Uh, temporal chains. Makes them move a little slower. Other effects on cursed. Enemies expire 40 something percent slower. Goody, 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 goody. Uh, increased critical strike chance, some accuracy. Good. Um, shit. Because this is a green curse, I have to change the color of those. There's nice elemental resistance against everything. This is higher. Gives me some chance to ignite. Actually, this does not work because I have more elemental damage on it. Um, but then again... If I change... Yeah, it just ups the card speed a little bit. Well, not just a little bit, but a lot. Uh, let's just go for another spell there. Glacial Cascade to compare this. It's either 15,000 or it's 17,000. Nice. But faster spells are better than higher damaging spells. So we can keep that one around. Hmm... All right, so yeah, the idea of elemental proliferation was a good one, but no. Okay, damn it. Just, uh, these abilities sound good only on paper, but if you really try them, you see where they, yeah, where they lag. Huh. And this one, because of the added cold damage, isn't that strong. Oh crap. Okay, Glacial Cascade, faster car speed, car speed, uh, physical is extra fire, that could work with another red, but I don't have another red, so I need another blue, I could go for like added uh, lightning damage, yeah, lightning damage could work, so let's change those, 8700, and added lightning damage goes in there. Okay, just 30,000, 30, yeah, 13,000 damage. It's not that great though, so where is it lacking? It's like, that one is maxed, that one is maxed, that one is not maxed yet, so that's good. Glacial Cascade was maxed, quality and otherwise. Alright, that one also can be maxed afterwards. So... All right, let's keep that one around. Uh, what about this one now? Increased damage. Mm, okay, 14,000, but it has the culling thing on it. But I have to get them below 10%. Like, that's the thing. Um, if I lose 10% of the damage... Mm -hmm. And I do lose more than 10% of the damage. Uh, then, like, that's the thing. Like, everything t uh, lower than 10% of life gets killed. But if I lose 10% of the damage, then this effect doesn't work. Like, if I have this on, but I still lose 10% of the... Like, more than 10% of the damage, then that's not great. Um, okay, let's go back for the cold damage. Could just uh, change it to the way it was before, just with the added uh, fire damage on there, so I can still use flame ability. Okay, but we got cold damage, physical damage, and lightning. Where did the lightning damage come from now? Uh, the lightning damage comes from, I think the golem, right? No, it's not the golem. There's some other like, shenanigans going on there. There's probably some uh, add stones so much. Light there we go. 1 to 22 lightning damage to spells. Uh, Nothing, basically. <laughs> nice. Um, hmm. 
Okay, so it does physical and mostly cold damage. Mm, added fire is nice and all, but uh, I don't seem to use that, so let's just keep it somewhere else. Mm, flame blast is some boss killer stuff. Fire penetration cannot be used. Um, keep that one there. Conductivity. No, the highest is cold, so I should actually go for uh, uh, frostbite. Frostbite, there we go. Okay. So we get everything that we need. <laughs> we got something uh, for conductivity. We got something for uh, flameability. For the flame blast there. Actually, uh, like Stormcall was supposed to be the spell that's fast and like reliable. But the one that's most reliable is Glacier Cascade at the moment. Uh, so I can actually get rid of storm call and conductivity. So let's just place that down there. Uh, and storm call also down there. So let's go to this one. Uh, that skill physical damage to lightning conversion. Let's see if that is actually good. Uh, I actually think that's not that great. Hmm. Because this one, 42% of physical damage is extra fire damage. It just adds 42%. This one changes. Uh, yeah, those percentages. Like 50% converted from physical to lightning. Uh, but there's no like lightning to uh, lightning to cold damage change. That's not going to happen. Like, you could go from cold to fire. That's easy. So, I could actually do... Yeah, put this on there. Put some cold damage on there. I think the values are the same. Like, cold to fire conversion might be similar to... Uh, the physical to lightning conversion. But what I need would just be another, uh, like... Yeah... Something like this. But monsters to flee. A boss is not supposed to be a monster. Everything else is kind of a monster. But alright. 35% uh, physical damage. Yeah, what happens if I get rid of this? Uh, on the damage. So let's get hatred on there again. So this is uh, 16,900. Mm, there we go. And this is 20,000 with hatred. Ooh. Physical damage is added as extra cold. Okay. What else we got? Um, do we have a herald here somewhere? Probably not. Like ice herald? Sorry? No. Herald, herald, herald. Uh, there's no herald. Herald! Uh-uh. No herald. Too bad. Like, that one could be really sweet. Uh, increase chill duration on enemies. Da, 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 da. But it's more damage with hits and damage against chilled enemies. Yeah, that could, that could actually that could really help. Um, so yeah, 30 something. Okay. So, chance to freeze enemies which are chilled, chilled. Da, 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 More damage with hits and ailments against chilled enemies. Yeah. 37% more damage. It's kind of like the. Yeah, kind of. Uh, I think it would max out at 39% or so, maybe even 40 something. Yeah, hypothermia. Let's just read up on this. So, hypothermia. Uh, hypothermia support is maxed out. Yeah, uh, at 39% more damage. Increased chill duration is only the quality on it. Um, so, we don't really need that. Mm, it just does generally more damage uh, against chilled enemies then there's the okay this one does 84 percent more elemental damage which is even better but they don't inflict any ailments which means there's uh like the chill trigger wouldn't work um that's one thing but it would be yeah it wouldn't need the chill trigger it would just deal more damage it's actually pretty good but on the other hand i need the cc to kind of uh yeah Get myself to safety. Then we got 41% more spell damage. But it doesn't crit. But I need the crit to up the damage even more. 
And this one is the support duration, but this is not the duration spell. So that's also a bit iffy. That one doesn't work with totems, but it's pretty nice to have. That is just for burning damage, more fire, and chance to ignite new. All right, there's not that much. Uh, do we have like increased? Uh, well, uh, yeah, let's go for increase because maybe there's like increases or something. Um, yeah, the orb of storm can actually be really helpful. Uh, increase lightning damage. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, shit. The problem right now, that's a bit, that's not bad. Um, it's really iffy is that I took those three nodes here. No, not these three, damn it. Uh, these three nodes here. Uh, increased lightning damage, lightning damage, and multi crit effect on shock and car speed and whatnot. But I don't use lightning damage at all. Um, that's a little bit of a problem there. So you should actually go for like... Um, ah, the, ah, huh. I have one refund point and I could get... I could try to refund those three. But I could only get like one, two, and this third one. Uh, I also can't go to this cold damage section because you need another fourth one to get close to it. Um, where's something that I could take away there? The cre uh, increased crit strike chance is pretty sweet. The mana regeneration is even better. Uh, shy. But the, yeah, this is something for like... Uh, for additional... Uh, okay, haste. <sighs> haste is a nice idea, but in the end, it uh, doesn't really work out. Mm, this is just has better damage. 17,000. Wait, how did... Yeah, this is 20. And let's just hope this is better. Mm, all right, the flame ability and flame blast we keep there to kind of mm, blade for hypothermia. Uh, supported skills have 10% chance to freeze enemies which are chilled. Huh. Uh, they have to get chilled first. The problem is there's no cold damage on there at all. Like this one does some cold damage. Uh, this one does physical to lightning damage, but there's no additional cold damage. I just took that away. Ooh, that's not good. Ooh, that's not good. Definitely not good. So I wouldn't be able to use this. And the only thing that I could go for is like culling strike with a little bit more increase. Yeah. Damn it. My mana is spent. Alright, let's keep that one around and see if it's better or not. Oh boy. Oh boy. Bloody hell. I wanted to go for some lightning damage, but no. This build demands cold. So, anyway, next is what? Uh, I am going for another map, another moon temple. Good thing is I... Wait, this was not the one. The precinct. No, where, where's the bloody precinct? This is the one. Yeah. Oh, really iffy. But yeah. Finished it. So, Moon Temple. I actually want to go... Yeah, I want to try to get to the center. Uh, Moon Temple. Moon Temple is finished. So, I could... Uh, I don't need to fight the boss here. Uh, so, I can just rare this. And it's right now. Uh, what is it? Area Goatmen, Rogue Exiles, Vulnerability, okay. Curses, less effect. Ah, oh, come on. That is so mean. This is the reason why I'm gonna try to get Blade Fall. Because there's not always 
Uh, something negative like uh, they have so and so much resistances or whatever. Uh, hey, physical damage seems to be the easier way to go. Oh fuck, it's just the mana cost that really annoys me. Ah oh, crap, yeah, there was something about the mana cost. Okay, so yeah, Lightning Golem is just there to actually give me responsiveness. Uh, so I can cast faster and stuff. The thing is... Uh, yeah, and then I had uh, haste. Oh, it's just the general... Yeah, why am I not just going back to haste again? Like, it's cast speed that I need, right? Uh, and like little... Ooh. A little more physical damage is not that necessary. In order to clear stuff fast, I need clear speed. Attack speed. Not attack damage. Or spell damage. Or whatever damage. And I also need to look out for my mana. Because if I don't, I'm kind of screwed. Okay, that's that. And the section up there I've been explored. Uh oh. Ooh. To do something about the mana cost. That's just so iffy. Like you got your nice spell, but for some reason, this spell that works the best has the highest mana consumption. Like this is. <laughs> okay, mineral pool. Oh wait, that's a new one, isn't it? Oh, that was ooh, fast. These were the yeah two additional rogue exiles, and we got some onyx amulet. That is it. I have to say, like, the chromas are almost all collected. That's good. Yee. Oh, no. Mmm. No. Oh. I so annoying. You see some enemy, and you're like, everything dies immediately, and then this one does not die, so why not? You're always getting surprised by this nonsense. That's just so iffy. Hello. It'd be See nice to soon. have different health bars on different enemies, depending on what their power level is. Supposed to be like bosses have a different health bar than any other type of enemy. That would be sweet. That would be really, really nice. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. Mm, yeah, movement speed, cast speed. Don't need damage. I need more speed. There it is. Rustic sash. Yep, yep. And I think now I can finish the recipe. So I need boots. Uh, I need a hand piece. 
And uh, don't need the shield specifically. Okay, war axe is that no single handed? Uh nice ball regalia, let's take that one as well. Kinda wanna try the boss still. That could work. Nice scoring. Oh yeah. <laughs> Hmm. Yeah, the enemy should be... Okay, wait. Uh, is Cesaro immune to chill? Probably. Like, that's the thing. There's just one mechanic that just does not work. You can't go uh, and just buff yourself with that hypothermia against Cesaro. That's so mean. So, uh, strong box do I have? Yes. Okay, we got that one, that one, that one, that one. Uh, I already got the armor piece, but no, this is the wrong armor piece. I need this one uh, for the recipe. And uh, 200 weapons still missing. It can't be frozen would be all right, but can't be chilled is a bit, yeah. Anyway, uh, so yeah, let's just look up Izaro. Uh, Izaro. Uh, cannot be knock knocked back. 60% uh, less curse effectiveness. That's everything. Okay. That's everything. You can be stunned, frozen, everything. Okay. Uh, is there something that actually increases the chance of uh, freezing something? There are these uh, proliferation spells. If I take this, then he should be cake wall, right? Really easy. So, how many times did I die here? I think not that many times. Ah, no monsters, no anything. Except for, like, wait. No, uh, it's a sapphire. Can you freeze lock something? I just hope so. But the freeze is probably uh, dependent on the damage you deal compared to their maximum health. And bosses have an awful lot of maximum health, so... Um, yeah, let's read up on freeze. And try to improve on that. Uh, freeze. Freeze, 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 freeze. Uh, freeze is an element, da 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 da. Eh, but only if you crit. So, I crit an awful lot, so I should do this as well. So, base freeze duration is 60 milliseconds. So, 0 0.06 seconds. Uh, for every 1% of the target's maximum life. <laughs> Before party scaling, dealt by cold damage. Which means I can't do that. Now, what about stun, by the way? What about stun? Um, so, what about stun? Because stun uh, has different values. So, uh, stun recovery. Uh, stun chance. Stun duration. Oh, come on, where's the thing? Stun, uh, so yeah, stun duration can be calculated by using the following. Uh, so whether or not a stun occurs can be calculated by da 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 da. Um, the chance of stun is based off the damage done in a single hit compared to the target's maximum life. Okay, uh, the default length is 350 milliseconds, so it's larger, much larger than the like more than five times. Uh, 
larger duration than the freeze duration. A significantly long stun duration da -da -da, will also display a swirling circle. Da -da -da. The duration of stuns can be altered by that. Right? Stun duration can be calculated using the following formula, whether or not... Uh, okay, stun duration. Attacker stun duration uh, minus defender's stun recovery. Okay. This one multiplied by 350. Okay. Uh, where do you find this, uh, effective max life in equation two is what the maximum life of the creature would be in a single power map. Increases to monster's life from a party mode. Da -da -da. Um, stun threshold. No, what is it? Stun chance. 200 times damage divided by defender's effective maximum health. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, 200 chance, 200 times this, okay, very interesting. So if you at least deal 50% of the damage uh, of the enemy health, it's 100% likely, basically. Uh, it's 50% likely if you do 25% damage. Hmm. Uh, and then it goes down there. Anyway. Um, freeze. So basically to do the, for every 1% of the target's maximum life dealt by cold damage. For every 1%. Which means if I deal 50%, uh, it's 60 milliseconds times 50, which is uh, 0.3 milliseconds. Hmm. Uh, but just kind of like um, freezing them multiple times every so often is just so nice. Uh, up to a maximum of, yeah, 50% of the duration would be below 0.3 seconds. The freeze effect is not applied. But what? If the duration would be below 0.3 seconds, the freeze effect is not applied. Wait, what? Okay, base freeze duration is 60 milliseconds. Right. Uh, for every 1% of the target's maximum life before that, dealt by cold damage up to a maximum of 50%. Okay. If the duration would be below 0.3 seconds, the freeze effect is not applied. So you actually have to... Uh, instantly deal more than 50% of their, like, what? What? This makes no sense. Like, this totally cancels this. Um, freeze duration can be lengthened by effects such as the freeze duration node and the passive tree. Temporal chains curse slow timers, but does not affect duration stats, which means it does not count toward 0.3 second minimum, but will uh, cause the real duration of freeze to be longer. When a target is frozen, it is also chilled. Da, 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 da. Uh, non unique enemies that are killed by frozen chatter into pieces. These undev effects are not supported. Da, da, da. Again, um, so a hit of damage that has a chance to freeze is capable of inflicting freeze. Good. Critical strikes inherently have a 100% chance to freeze. Uh, by default, only cold damage is able to uh, inflict freeze. But certain equipment, such as free da, 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 uh can change the which damage types are uh, able to inflict freeze. Base freeze duration is 60 milliseconds for every 1% of the target's maximum life dealt by cold damage. The thing is dealt by cold damage. If you don't deal with cold damage, then... Uh, but the... Yeah, how am I going to get more cold damage? Like, I need physical to cold uh, conversion somehow. Otherwise, this is not going to work. Um, dealt by cold damage up to a maximum of 50%. If the duration would be below 0 0.3 seconds, which is... Ah, okay. So, um, if you would deal damage uh, only worth like 5% of the enemy maximum health, probably bosses, uh, the freeze will not be applied. So, you have to do these... Uh... Oh, come on. That means bosses are uh, unable to be frozen just because you can't deal like 5% uh, of the damage.
mana is spent. Come on. I'm bleeding here. I'm bleeding here. Oh shit. Still bleeding. No, 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 no. Is the enemy freezing? And probably not. Can't really say. It's cold out there. Come on. Get get killed. So we got the Yeah, still need the hammer. Anyway, we got everything that we need. So okay. Uh we do that one. Uh that's the and this one. Uh, so uh this is that for the this is not for the chroma. Why did I take this is for the recipe? This is for the chroma. This has shitty values. This also has shitty values. This is there for the chroma again. The rest is there for the recipe. And we keep that. So you the recipe. Takes like uh, this and makes some energy you kind of need, and also another ray. Mm. Hello. So, so you can take this one, 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 this one. Am I missing something? Gloves, right? Gloves. Uh, they get. Very nice. We'll very 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 nice so i will be placed up there same as this one this one and this one and map pieces coming here one in eight is this free stuff goes in there um uh, basically and also this will be placed down there there have to be some gloss right come on give me some gloss 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 there's yeah Hmm. There's a stuff there. This is like okay. Kinda sad. Uh gloves. Just some some ordinary gloves. What happened to the gloves? Why do I still need gloves? I thought I had them somewhere. I have to be here, right? Right, right. So there's an opal one. Uh, there's an axe. I got boots. I got the headpiece. I got everything except gloves. Ooh, nice. For me, it feels like gloves are the most rare items in this whole game. There's an nice tricorn. There's another shield. There's a knife. My mana is spent. That's so strange. There are no gloves in here. Now, I thought amulets would be the rarest items. Okay, so... We got another war axe. Huh. Okay. Okay, uh, but we're going to take this one with us. Ah, no glass. Ha! Huh. Strange. So... That one can be placed up there. That one will be sold as... Is. And... The rest goes in there. Let me take this one. We need the amulet, of course. The two rings will be placed there. Then we have this and... This one on the right side. This one on there. And this one up here. And it's just gloves missing now. Ah, you gotta be kidding me. Alright. Which map comes up next? Uh, the... I could go for that. Yeah, I have to go for another moon temple. Do I? Kind of. So, let's upgrade that. 
Mm, make it rare as well. Range damage, elemental damage. Okay, they reflect. Can be dealt with. Damn it. Uh, yeah, what about the hatred? I, I just need more... More speed is always best. So let's just take haste in there. It's kind of nice that... Yeah. Hmm. Uh, okay. Now, the thing is, if you don't deal that much damage, then you can't freeze, right? Uh, you can deal more damage with, like, stronger attacks. Um, but if you just attack faster, then the freeze itself won't be that strong, right? Because you have to, like, instantly deal a lot of damage to utilize these uh, CC abilities. You can't just go for strength in order to do that. You have to go for, like, the attack itself has to be fast enough. Kind of thing. Okay, point three four. Point three seven. Okay, there's like no real difference there. Now let's just keep it as is. Come on, give me the bloody mana. So, okay, the moon temple. Did I really open it already? That was fast. So. Do -do 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 So, yeah, semite helmet. That's just great. Don't need that stuff, though. My strong boss is at the same relative position, right? That's the last one. Nice. Ah, uh, there's just no, yeah, no transmutation or whatnot. Let's see, maybe we can get one. Should just open it why not okay come on stop the backtracking just ooh. let's fight it okay this one's the last one nothing in it i thought so goody Yeah, all the items do make a sound, don't they? Except for maybe the useful uh, armor pieces. Gloves, nice. I found gloves. Problem is, they're there for another recipe. A more simpler one. Much simpler one. They are. Yeah, they're not even rare, so it wouldn't even work. There are no enemies up there. Yeah, oh, there we go. Yeah, now there's an orb of transportation. Uh, I always take them with you, it seems.
Okay, we got horns, we got a bow, we got everything again except for what? One, two, three. There we go. Let's hope there's no yeah explosion afterwards. That would be that would be great at all. There's a vibe. Yay! Give the boss or they give the essence thingy, and then suddenly bam, instant damage. At eight in the field. Okay, inventory still says yes. Need again, we got some nice claws there. Opal scepter, no, I don't need that one. Need them bloody claws. Is it really that the gloves are? No, it can't be. It just can't be. Actually, now I'm also looking for like bells and other stuff. Ooh. What do we got? We get a mask? Do we need the mask? On to the boss fight. Sniping from afar. I'm the one who's cheating, dude. I'm the one who's doing that, not you. Seems like every time he uses these uh, kind of charged up ooh, skill, he kind of pushes himself back a little bit. Eee. Yep, he does that. Good to know. Okay, must be done any moment. So, we got gloves. Perfect. We got some nice rings, some other knives. Needy. But yeah, that's done. So, alright. Uh, huh. uh, yeah, there were some alchemy thingies in there. So, let's take this one. And the Hooper's helmet. Uh, and that's it. The rest was just there for the chromas. Chroma, chroma, chroma. Not that great, and not that great. Okay, another chroma. Chroma. This is for the recipe. Some more rings. Yes, why not? Fate will find you. All right. So we're going for a this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. Hello. Uh oh, that's the wrong one. I need chaos, not regals. Okay, cancel that. Mm, 7467. That should do the trick. So. Nice. See you. Alright, like this is 79, 78, 78, 74. I need the respective level, otherwise I just can't get the currency that I need. Like, this is also a bit iffy, like, the higher the level, the more useless the currency gets, because just simply re-rolling would have been simpler than that. Okay, uh, that is something I don't really need. This one is something that I would. Uh, the Shed Beach at uh, 6, the 